As researchers make attempts to pierce the veil on the shrouded mystery of our collective past, they have found startlingly strange artifacts and ancient stones. Some of these tell peculiar stories and force experts to question previously held assumptions. Some odd discoveries have been found all around the world and point to impossible to explain moments in history that are left relatively unanswered even to this day. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be going over three mysterious ancient stone artefacts that have been discovered worldwide. The Cockno Stone The stone, which is found in Scotland's Western Bartonshire, is by far among the most interesting and beautiful Bronze Age cup and ring carvings in Europe. It's known for its grooved spirals, geometric shapes, carved indentations, and many types of mysterious patterns. It measures approximately 42 feet long and 26 feet wide, featuring about 90 grooved spirals and carved indentations together with a ringed cross and a pair of four-toed feet. The Cockno Stone was discovered by Reverend James Harvey in 1887. Interestingly though, Back in 1964, various archaeologists from Glasgow University said the artefact should be buried in the ground. This was to protect it from thieves and vandals. It's been buried under the earth for 51 years, with housing developments also posing a threat to the safety of the stone. In 2015, September, the stone was excavated and exposed for 36 hours. This was for researchers and archaeologists to study, collect information, and take images to create replicas, after which it was again buried. The marks of cup and ring are a form of prehistoric art that consists of a concave depression, which is less than a few centimetres across. It's carved on the surface of the rock, and is mostly surrounded by circles that are also etched onto the stone. The decorations occur as petroglyphs on natural borders and outcrops, and on megaliths like stone circles and passage graves. They are mostly found in northern England, northwest Italy, Scotland, northwest Spain, Switzerland, Ireland, Portugal, and central Greece. Similar forms have also been found in other parts of the world, including India, Brazil, and Mexico. Despite the fact the original meaning that was contained in the Cockno Stone is now lost, people have put forward theories suggesting its possible purpose. Some suggest that the ancient writing links back to a spiritual meaning. Others, however, have said that it could have no link to star maps and celestial objects. It's no secret that our ancient ancestors were fascinated with the cosmos. Over the years, various artefacts and writings have been found, and these have shown modern researchers that our ancestors tried to understand the solar system and everything inside it. According to some, it's a map showing other settlements in the valley. Others say it was maybe used in sacrificial ceremonies, where water or milk was poured into the grooves. Or as mentioned, it's an astronomical map which indicated constellations as a guide to prehistoric farmers for when they needed to complete their harvests. Many of the carvings are situated near, or incorporated into, burial mounds, thus linking the symbols somehow to burial beliefs and practices concerning the ancestors and an afterlife. Various researchers have come forward though, and have said they found similar looking designs. This is in places where people have been buried. Various researchers can't seem to agree on what the stone depicts. As of today, it's anyone's guess as to what the designs mean. The Inga Stone Rising amidst the water of the Inga River in Brazil, the stone is a treasure in archaeology that has remained controversial to date. The Inga Stone is 45 metres long and 4 metres high. It has mysterious geometrics scattered across it, all of which are different sizes. Despite the fact that researchers have speculated the origin and implication of the symbols, it's not yet been possible to demonstrate with surety that the theories are factual. Considering that the rock's origin is over 6,000 years old, the Inga Stone is a global archaeological wonder. There are other stones, in addition to caves in the Inga Stone surrounding, that have engraved surfaces, but not at the same level of complexity in style and elaboration as the Inga Stone. 
An archaeologist and researcher encountered one of the caves where this artifact was discovered, and after looking around, several more were discovered. One researcher has examined a total of 497 symbols on the cave walls. Most of the engravings in Inga have a dark significance, even though some undoubtedly represent celestial elements, two of which have been observed to be practically identical to Orion's Milky Way constellation. Other interpretations of the petroglyphs include animals, fruits, human figures, weapons, and primitive indexes. These stories are segmented with each of the symbols, and they connect to the chapter they correspond to. Professor Rolum, who is also a specialist in Latin, Greek, and theology, has stated that the symbols of the Inga stone have a similar design to other engravings. This includes those of Phoenician engravings. Other researchers have made observations of the possible relationship of the symbols with the ancient runes, and have made further confirmations that they're similar in complexity and linear arrangement with a possible passage of religious scriptures. According to experts, the circles appearing engraved on the Inga stone could have a relationship with phallic symbols. The spiral shapes could mean transcosmologic trips or displacements, possibly as a result of shamanic trances. In this sense, the series of symbols can thus point to an ancient formula engraved on the Inga stone, possibly used for accessing a door to the supernatural world. According to other researchers, there's a chance that the ancient prints were a warning to the future about the proximity of a global disaster. It was said that people of the time would have preserved their technology from a previous civilization. The idea that there's multiple languages etched on the artifact has caused researchers to put forward different theories. There's been no historical evidence up to today that links stars and constellations with the Brazilian natives of this era. There's a possibility that the engraving artists were part of a nomadic civilization that visited the region temporarily. Regardless of which theory is correct, one thing that is certain is that these carvings were significant. Hopefully, as our knowledge and technology advances, will be able to discover more about this ancient artifact. The Petoni Skystone Our planet, over billions of years, has attracted several meteorites crashing onto its surface. The Petoni Skystone is one such meteorite. The stone was discovered in Sierra Leone in 1990 by Angelo Petoni. Angelo was a geologist and archaeologist, the skystone is known for its bluish hue and being made up of mostly oxygen. Local legends have said that the stones were actually creatures that lived in the sky and were thrown down on earth to remain buried beneath the soil, since God was disturbed by their wrongdoings. After discovering it, Petoni sent the stones for analysis in laboratories in Tokyo, Rome and Germany. The tests returned and showed that the stone's composition was 77% oxygen and 20% carbon and lime. The analysts also found traces of silicon and other materials. Researchers made conclusions that the stone was different from Earth stone, and suggested that it likely came from outside of the planet. The carbon dating analysis revealed that the stone landed on Earth between 2,500 and 17,000 years ago. Pieces of the Petoni Skystone have been collected and regarded as highly valuable. Today, the story of the Petoni Skystone has regained interest due to the ancient aliens of the History Channel. It was featured on here and started up a whole new conversation. The mystery of the Skystones, however, may be coming to an end. This is because various companies have tested the stone. There is still some belief in its strangeness. Various researchers have tried to get their hands on samples of this rock, but it's proven to be difficult. One dealer in Hong Kong is said to have had a piece of this rock. When the dealer took it to be tested, he said that the results concluded that the rock was unidentifiable, and that no one could determine its composition. A researcher tried to purchase this piece of stone from the dealer, but the dealer didn't want to sell it to him because of how rare it was. The researcher left empty-handed. A sample remained on display at Switzerland's Erich von Daniken's museum together with the statues that represented the strange beings from the sky. 
Unfortunately, the museum couldn't give away the sample of the stone. As a last resort, the research went back to the same gem dealer from Hong Kong, and to his surprise, the dealer was open to talks. The researcher then took the stone to the University of Washington's Division of Earth and Space Sciences. They tested the stone on the 6th of March 2019. In a twist, they too verified that the stone is unlike anything on Earth. This has only caused some people to speculate where this interesting stone came from, and so far, various different theories have been put forward. So what do you make of these interesting discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community whilst working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.